Welcome to the Suerte del Molino farm, Andalusia in Spain. Here we are ready to plant, but what we want to plant has not shown up yet. We are planting water and the rain has not showed up as yet. In the meantime, we have done lots of preparations a series of great days ahead of us, inauguration of a lot of features, trial, the test of many features, and uh, we're looking forward to be proven wrong or right, doesn't matter. We learn, we can adjust, we can fix, in the meantime, <clears throat> I am looking for stones and suddenly I see a lot because this whole canal here should be filled with stones. I poured some water in there just to see how fast it runs and it's fast. Today I've completed what I wanted to do here, each opening <coughs> I have used a lot of stone and concrete to create just a an area that will not erode and now the stones must come all the way down there. What a beautiful, wonderful feeling that this is coming to an end. So, the water, first of all, must fill up. It will take a lot of water. If it rains hard for half an hour, it can be full. If not, uh, it might take many days. When the water reached this level, about here, middle of this block, the cinder block, it will start flowing in this canal um, to irrigate everything on that side. There is no block, sluice gate control there. That one can flow whenever it wants because uh, this is the main aim of this whole distribution pond. Should there be more water, I can open here and the water can come down here and it runs to the lowest wells. Um, I can also water them from the highest well, so it's not an issue to get water in the highest well that is the main important aspect. And then I have also completed On this side, a permanent spillway. So there where the border collies are, that is a permanent elevated area. It's uh, halfway into that block. And uh, should there be a lot of water, which I hope will happen sometime, then the water can leave this way. There's a huge canal for it. And also the same as on the other side, I can open here and the water can go to the bottom canal, uh, swell system. So the first 
thing that still needs to be done is to install this gate here. I will have a horizontal metal bar there. Then suspend this metal grid on it. And when the water comes in, it can push it, you can lift it. But uh, I don't expect that will happen, except if there's some organic debris in there. It might happen, but uh, then it can go back. And uh, then the dogs cannot get out, and the pigs cannot get in. Another thing that must be done is we have to remove this coarse sand from here. Uh, I knew we will not use everything, but I had to decide between dropping it off where it will stay, or and then I have to push up the sand that I want to use for the concrete, or have it here and push it down. Obviously, I would prefer to push it down or just run it down instead of spending a lot of energy getting it up here. It's quite strenuous. It uh, doesn't look that much, but after 20 wheelbarrows full of sand, you know you've done some a good day's job. Then, <coughs> To level this out, this area here, and uh, there's no rush for that. Even if there is a, a hollow open area here, it can fill up with water, it's not a problem. So this is the lower canal, it uh, follows a big arch because I was confronted with this boulder here. I started opening it up and then I just closed it again. The excavator moves and the rock stays. It's not what I wanted. Then here also will be filled with stones, perhaps up to here. A lot of seepage, leakage will take place here. It's not a problem for me. Um, this is a distribution pond. I don't expect it to hold water. Even if it does have a lot of seepage, leakage, it will actually serve this area, some moisture for this upper area, all good. Then I have to move the excavator and finish the middle canal. This is the old erosion gully. The whole area used to look like this and then it just went into the street. Now we have remodeled it. That is the lower swale system. And then this canal here is the middle system, middle swale system down here. And this is where I have to do some work to finish it towards the end. And this is the upper swale system that worked very well last year when we have had a pipe from the culvert to feed this. Exciting times ahead! In a week's time it looks like we have might have some rain, 
perhaps 20, 30 millimeters in total. Uh, it's not too bad, especially for the first rain. It's good. We're looking forward to all these things. We worked very hard this summer. We are tired, but we are happy. This is what we wanted to complete. And now the distribution pond is ready. Just more rocks, remove the sand, install the gate. Anyway, the rain can come, it can handle it. Till next time, goodbye.